Welcome to Beyond Today's podcast, brought to you by Beyond Today. What a beautiful place it is. Thanks, guys, for being here. I really appreciate it. Um, what we're doing something different now is hopefully that uh, we can do this every week and that is I'd like to um, talk to you a little bit about what's coming up at uh, Beyond Today and some of the beautiful classes that we have coming up. Um, today is February 21st of 2017. And... Um, Looking at the old calendar and that, uh, what's coming up here is we have a neck release on February 22nd at 1 p.m. That's tomorrow at uh, 1 p.m. Uh, we also have a Reiki share that's coming up here on February 25th at uh, 6.30 p.m. Uh, brought to you by Pam. Pam is uh, one of the beautiful practitioners here. That she's very... She's awesome at her energy work and everything else. That If you've never been to an energy share or a Reiki share, this is what you need to come to in that. It's very relaxing, very beautiful. And step by step, they'll show you how, what to do and everything else, and you'll never feel lost. It's just a beautiful feeling. That, And then we have Reiki 3 and Masterclass, which is ART and Masterclass coming up here. That is going to be February 26th. That is at 10 a.m. in the morning. That uh, You must have taken Reiki 1, 2. You already must have been signed up already because we had to order books and that for this too. So you just make sure that you're if you're coming, come now, okay? <laughs> you you got to be here. At, uh, at, it's your should be already signed up. Then we have a management training interview technique class. That's March 1st at uh, 9 a.m. Now, most of these classes are for LMTs. Um, they're also can be for anybody, but you get continuing education for most of these classes. And that. So, but anybody can take these classes. Then March 5th, we have a stress management class. That's another one for LMTs or anybody. Um, we have another one that's a stretching class, and it's a lower body stretching class. And that's really awesome. Um, you can get some continuing education for that. Um, then we have Move Your Business Forward on March 9th, and... I, I like this these classes that uh, you can go to the num uh, beyond today, uh, beyond the number two day dot com and, that, and you can look up all these classes they're online that um, there's we've been doing a lot of work and uh, getting them online and uh, getting them out there. <clears throat> I'm very excited about these beautiful classes and that and we also have some other classes that's coming up that don't forget um, on the twenty second is um, at six thirty p.m. a free grief recovery intro. That's, don't forget that. It's on the 22nd. Uh, it's a free grief uh, recovery intro. Uh, that'll be tomorrow night. So don't forget to show up for that. That's going to be beautiful. Last weekend we had a kind of fun class. So we, we did the Eastern head, Indian Head Massage. That was a lot of fun. We enjoy, I enjoy that thoroughly. Uh, if uh, you ever get a chance to come take that class, it's just a bunch of, uh, again, uh, if you love your head, massaged and you love to have um, your head rubbed in that that's a perfect class for you i loved it i love everything about that class and then of course you know the master class coming up here in that uh, um, kind of exciting stuff that's coming up here and to be on today we have um, <clears throat> a lot of great practitioners here at beyond today they they're all here that uh, are they're one of the best of the best in that we have massage therapists we have readers we have color therapists um we also have psychotherapists, so we have social workers here, we have a shaman here. Um, we have a, a lot of beautiful people here that do a lot of beautiful work, and that you should check us out and uh, try out some of the stuff that we do. And that uh, myself, I'm a structural therapist, I'm also a motivational speaker, I'm a teacher, I love teaching, um, that's one of my passions. And that, but I'm also, I, I do a lot of speaking around uh, Arizona and, and other places, and that so kind of take a look at what we do we 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 have fun to what we do i always kind of like to highlight somebody and that um, one of my dear friends and one of my dear friends is jane elizabeth she's been a dear friend of mine for a long time i just love 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 jane elizabeth uh what a beautiful soul she is and uh, she has this website it's, it's www.janeelizabeth.com and uh, i was reading through it today this she's got some really great stuff on there uh, one of the things is Sun in Pisces. So she talks about that from February 18th to March 20th. Uh, the, the Sun is in Pisces. And, of course, the Sun highlights the sign of Pisces from approximately February 18th to March 20th, highlighting the home, the mother, and Mother Earth. 
which is kind of amazing. But Pisces is a water sign, therefore we may see more water in and around the home. And if you attract flooding or an unexpected release of water in or around the home, that is a sign of out of control emotions, you know, challenges are imbalanced in the femininity. Water issues clogging drains and such as symbolic and changes in imbalance of femininity. As the sun highlights the sign of Pisces, you may be filled with desire to clear, cleanse, and organize or redecorate your home. You may be filled with the desire to move into a new home. Your material spirit or a mother figure in your life is highlighted. The material spirit ignites from you, possibly filling you with the desire to love, new, uh, nurture, and care for another. And by the way, the sun in Pisces assists you in finding a new home and finding great items for your home. It's time to redecorate. It's time to take a look at some of these beautiful things. And that. If you want to learn more about uh, what Jane Elizabeth has to offer on that, you can go to janeelizabeth.com, and that's janeelizabeth.com. Um, take a look at some of the great information she has there. She's a wonderful person, uh, Jane Elizabeth herself. She's a psychic medium astrologer, and she's also an author of Messages of the Stars, and she's somebody that's I think is pretty special in my life in that. Um, I, I use her a lot, talk to her a lot, and then, you know, she, she helps me out in a lot of things. Appreciate it, you guys. I appreciate everything about you guys. Uh, it's been a blessing. I hope you guys enjoy these weekly podcasts and that, uh, uh, we're going to have some beautiful guests coming up here. Cindy's going to be coming back into the podcast world with me and we're going to do some beautiful guests. We had some equipment issues and I think we got to figure it out. So I hope to see you later. Have a great day. That's beyond today.